Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Uh, today we are going to be doing a reaction video uh, in connection with my favorite team's performance in IPL 2024. So without further delay, let's uh, start the reaction. Uh, do you know which is my favorite team in the Indian domestic league? I think so. Can it's the Royal Challengers Bengaluru. Yes, that's right. Do you know where they are uh, on the ten points table? No idea. And I feel 2004. Okay. I mean, take a guess. There's There are 10 teams in the league. So 1 to 10, basically. 1 to 10. What's the position? Third. Not bad. Really? I mean... It's uh, it's uh, not a good. I mean, not bad. <laughs> whatever, whatever. But Royal Chal Challengers Bengaluru, their point. They are at the tenth position. Oh, really? In the points table. This so they're year. doing the worst. Yeah, they are the worst team. Oh no! Of India. I mean, in the league, not in within like. Oh, okay, the in the best, basically. They are in the best. No, no, no. They are at the last. There's only 10 teams in the total ten teams in India. In India, yeah, there's oh. only, only 10 teams have the contract to play in the league and Ouch. we are at the 10th position now. I see, I see. Yeah. That's, uh, that's yeah, sad. That is sad. Yeah. Do you want to know the reason why? Yes. Uh, so I think in my like honest opinion, there are three reasons. I think, I don't know who manages the talent in RCB, but they are really, really bad at it and they mm. should be fired. It's been the case for a long time with Royal Challengers Bangalore. Uh, like they bring in good talent, but they don't perform. And then at like final, after like a couple of seasons or you know, like maybe three, four seasons, they release those people. They go to a different team and then they perform really well. <laughs> that, mm, that's doesn't sound good, right? That doesn't sound good. Has happened so many times. Mm. And some of these people, they go to a team which end up winning the league. But how come? Uh, that's exactly my point. I think the talent management is really wow. bad at RCB. I don't know who's doing it. They need to be fired. So the same person that they get rid of is yeah. winning for another team. He's doing, yeah. He's like he's winning like, he's one of the best for performer wow. which made the other team to win. That is a shame. To, to like give you a couple of examples, Shivam Dube, uh, I don't think you know these guys. Definitely anyway. not. Shyam Dume is one guy, and then the other guy that comes to my mind is Shane Watson. He's an Australian cricketer, and the other person that comes to my mind is uh, Chahal. He's is is a leg spinner bowler. He's doing so well in this season. He was thrown out of the team like a couple of seasons ago, and uh, yeah. So that's one reason I think why mm -hmm. RCB is struggling. The second reason is the approach to modern day cricket i think their approach is still old school it's really bad compared to like how other some of the other teams are you know like approaching uh like t especially you know mm -hmm. this for format of cricket like as some sunrises hyderabad is one team that comes to my mind their approach is i think what modern day T20 cricket should be. They are doing exceptionally well. Uh, so yeah, the approach is really bad. It's old school, too old school to be to have an impact in today's. Mm. Like, I mean, yeah. any s you take any sport with data analytics, with all of these, you know, like modern day technology, strategy, database strategy, or you know, like performance based strategy, with all these resources. Uh, Every year, the cricket is evolving. Every year, mm. it's evolving fast. And the other teams, they are able to adapt. But RCB, it's really bad. Honestly, I've, I've, I've been such a big fan of this team. But it's, it's really bad. And the last and third reason why they are struggling is the pitch in, uh, in Bangalore, where mm -hmm. they play half of their games. It suits cricket like you know like batsmen uh but they're not bringing in the team that suits for the pitch and well i mean it's it's too batting friendly maybe so it doesn't matter what kind of bonus you have 
you can have world class bowlers i think mitchell stark who is also also from australia has been he's been one of the best for quite some time one of the best for yeah and he couldn't do very well in in like bang, bang, in, on in bangalore mm-hmm. stadium it's because you know the pitch is too batting friendly i think they need to make some correction to this they need to uh, like build a pitch which will suit our players we don't have the batsmen that can do score like 230 runs 250 runs every single match we don't have that kind of talent sadly so they need to give some uh, like bowling bowling friendly elements in the pitch to our bowlers as well because they just lose the heart to compete in the in the league because they have to play, play seven games on this pitch on this pitch where they will struggle every single time they play they will struggle i think that it's just mentally mentally really bad mm-hmm. for them so i think those are the three reasons but on the bright side in 2024 the rcb women's team oh, they won the they, they won the championship with they were not the strongest team in the league but they somehow they made it they won it But maybe they should i don't know if ask the women what they are doing because they're doing something right true they're doing something right and i don't know if the talent management is the same for b- w- men and women so that's my i mm. like open open and question well, to the i guess maybe they should ask for some training internship yeah send their men to the women team yeah that's for sure yeah. <laughs> well <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed my I mean it wasn't so much your reaction. It's I don't know so much about cricket. Yeah. It's my reaction and my analysis of RCB's performance in this year's IPL. Mm. Really bad if you are an R- RCB fan like a diehard RCB fan like I am. It's it's heartbreaking really. But hopefully they will recover. Hopefully there will be some some changes in the team, some changes in the management as well. Coaching they recently had coaching like changes in the coaching as well. Be but the team. performance just got worse. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so well. I don't know. We need answers. We need answers. We need solutions. And uh, hopefully it will come fast in our service way. Thank you. And if you guys like what we are doing here, please do not don't forget, forget to, to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like our videos. And if you have any other things to know about in our service performance in 2024th year IPL Uh, please do let us know in the comment section. With that, I would like to say bye-bye and have bye. a good day.